Hi friends. It's been a long time since I've seen you and I miss you all. Today I'm going to show you how you can make some blocks using cardboard tubes in your home. So I have been collecting lots of cardboard tubes like this. So they come, you can get them from your toilet paper. I have some longer ones from paper towel rolls. And I even have some really long ones. These ones come from wrapping paper. So if you had been wrapping some gifts maybe you have some of these in your home too so what you're going to need are your cardboard tubes um, if you have something to color with maybe some markers or some crayons if you have some stickers you can use stickers and also you'll need some scissors but we want to be safe so the scissors are going to be used by a, <clears throat> a big person so your mom or your dad maybe a big sister or big brother or grandma and grandpa because we don't want you to get hurt. So what you're going to do first, if you want, if you have plain cardboard rolls like this, you can use your markers or your crayons. You can color on them. You can make some designs. Maybe you want to make them look like people. I'm doing this really quick. So here's a happy face. So you can color on them. Maybe you want to use some stickers if you have some stickers. So you can use your stickers and decorate your tubes. Here I have a princess and a frog. Maybe I'll add a little flower. So whatever you have, if you feel like decorating them, you can do that. And if you have some pretty paper, so I happen to have some pretty paper, and if you have a glue stick, you can also glue fancy paper onto your cardboard tubes to make them look different and give them some colors. Just uh, find what you have in your house and use it. And then you're gonna need some help from a big person. So they're gonna use the scissors and they're gonna cut some slits in your cardboard tubes. So like this. I do four, you could do more or less. You don't want to do too many, otherwise it'll it'll bend too much. So I just do one, two, three, four. Flip it over and do the other side as well. One, two, three, four. The, the slits don't have to line up, so you just have to cut them so that you could be able to stick them together. Here's one that I have with colorful paper on it. I'm going to do it again. One, two, three, four. Turn it around. One, two, three, four. So you can see I've made some cuts on the ends of my cardboard tubes, both ends, and then you can stick these together and you can build things up high. Oh, my sticker fell off. We lost a princess. So I started to build one here. These ones are already cut, <clears throat> but the more cardboard tubes that you collect, then the bigger you can make your tower. See, so this one's got a bunch of tubes stuck together. So instead of throwing out or recycling your cardboard tubes, start saving them. And when you have enough, you can decorate them if you want. And then you can ask a big person to help you cut them. And then you can use them to build. I wonder how big you can make your tower. I have lots of cardboard tubes, so I could make a really tall one if I wanted to. But this is something quick. And it uses things that you should have in your home. So try it out, start saving those cardboard tubes, and then next time I see you, you can tell me what you've built. Have fun!